This is breaking news. Brad Pitt is reportedly trying to move on with his life as Angelina Jolie makes new abuse allegations. He finally feels happy with Ian Stairman. Rumors around allegations of abuse against Brad Pitt have been swirling ever since that fateful day in 2016 aboard Brad and Angelina Jolie's private plane. And even though it's nearly six years later, they're not stopping now. In fact, Jolie's lawyers recently claimed that Pitt had been abusive toward Jolie even prior to the 2016 incident. Sources close to Pitt have fired back, saying that the new claims are a misdirection and distraction from their ongoing court battle regarding their French winery, Chateau Miravo. Keep reading for all the details. Angelina Jolie filed for divorce from Brad Pitt only days after the disastrous private plane ride in 2016. And in the years since, more details about what actually happened are being unveiled. According to an FBI report, Brad Pitt allegedly grabbed Jolie and shook her, pushed her into a wall, and punched the ceiling. Jolie herself said that Pitt behaved like a monster in front of their six children. And there are reports of Pitt getting physical with their son, Maddox, who was 15 at the time. Sources close to Pitt responded by saying that the accusations were a combination of exaggerations and lies. However, this week, according to a new court filing from Jolie's lawyers, the actress is claiming that her ex-husband was abusive toward her prior to the 2016 plane ride incident. While Pitt's history of physical abuse of Jolie started well before the family's September 2016 plane trip from France to Los Angeles, this flight marked the first time he turned his physical abuse on the children as well. Julie then immediately left him, the court filing reads. Sources close to Brad Pitt have called Angelina Julie's new claims a misdirection and distraction from the court case the two are involved in. Their fight over French winery Chateau Miraval. The two owned the castle together until Julie sold her half to Russian oligarch Yuri Scheffler in October 2021. Pitt's lawyers are attempting to prove that the sale was unlawful. Julie claims that she couldn't have sold her shares of Miraval to Pitt because Pitt would not let her sell her share of the winery to him unless she agreed to a more onerous and expansive NDA. In response, Pitt's lawyers said that the NDA he wanted her to sign was no more restrictive than the ones she asks others to sign on a daily basis. Though even further as to ask to say that Jolie's lawyers have proposed an even broader mutual non-disparagement clause to Pitt in connection to their divorce proceedings. Which leads us to the most recent news. On April 4th, Jolie's lawyers suggested the actor feared that sealed documents included in their separate, years-long custody battle could be made public without the NDA, which is where the above quote is from. A source close to Pitt says that accusations like this are part of a pattern of behavior for Julie's legal team. Whenever there is a decision that goes against the other side, they consistently choose to introduce misleading, inaccurate, and slash or irrelevant information as a distraction. The source. We suppose there is always three sides to every story. His side, her side, and the truth and it seems as if we will never find out what the latter really is. Despite all of this, the Bullet Train star is reportedly trying to put everything with his ex-wife behind him and move on with his life, which now includes new girlfriend Ayn Stairman. It also includes his and Jolie's 17-year-old daughter Shiloh, who recently revealed she wants to move in with him to mix things up. The long-drawn drama with Angelina used to really get to him, especially the custody drama and abuse allegations. A source reportedly told People, according to an article published on April 8th, it's been very stressful for him to have to defend over and over again. But since things don't seem to change, he's trying to move on with his life. Although he's always been surrounded by trusted friends, he still had years when he felt very lonely. The source continued, before going on to say how much he likes having the jewelry designer in his life. Sharing his life and living with Ains now makes him very happy. Ains is great. She doesn't come with any baggage and is able to just support him, 
added the insider.